Hey sweet friends, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new here. Today's video I am sharing with you a quick tidy up of my home but also kind of taking you along for the day. So we're starting out with breakfast. This morning I am making the kids some pancakes and they're also going to have some fruit and some yogurt on the side. So you will see that whole process of making them breakfast. After breakfast I will get to tidying up the home some we do have some errands to run today and then i need to come back home and do some weeding in a flower bed of mine and some planting of seeds so i'm going to share all of that in today's video i hope today's video gives you motivation and inspiration if you like videos like this please be sure to leave it a big thumbs up and let's go ahead and jump on into the day So as I mentioned earlier, the kids are going to have some yogurt as well as strawberries, grapes, and blueberries, and then some pancakes for breakfast. My kids are very big breakfast people, so they will eat a whole meal at breakfast. So I like to give them as much as they want, and today they wanted pancakes and yogurt. So we made the whole smorgasbord this, this morning, and they're going to enjoy that while I go ahead and clean up the kitchen. I have some dishes that I need to put in the dishwasher as well as some dishes to hand wash that won't fit in there and just kind of get the day started. Like I mentioned earlier, we do have some errands to run, so I'm going to tidy up a little bit, put some laundry to wash, go run those errands, and then come back and finish out the day.
And this was the point here where I put the laundry to wash and you're gonna see it right back to laundry, putting it to dry. And that's because in between the time that it was running is when we went out and ran our errands that we needed to do for the day. So I went out, ran those, and then came back and the laundry was ready to swap. So I'm swapping that and then we are going to get outside. I did want to mention as well, I'm gonna go ahead and link it in the cards above, but I do have a video Video sharing my 3,000 subscriber giveaway so if you haven't seen that video I'll go ahead and link it at the top of the cards for you so you can check that out and go enter that giveaway um, it is going to be drawn the Monday after Mother's Day and all the information is down in the description box of that video of how you can enter but I just recently hit 3,000 and that is so exciting and just to say thank you and give back to you guys I want to do a little giveaway just for a thank you besides just my words so definitely go check out that video and enter that giveaway for a chance to win there will only be one winner but I am just so excited for this for you guys. I'm going to do a random comment picker. So it's going to be completely random based off of the comments on the video. So definitely go check that out. So I shared in my Tuesday's video um, a Dollar Tree haul of getting these seeds. They were all four for a dollar and I looked for perennials, so something that will come up every year. Um, but we're gonna go ahead and plant these today. So we got some Shasta daisies, we got some cottage garden, and I think this one is like a mix of perennial and annual. Yeah, so some of them probably won't come back next year and then some of them will, but that's fine. Um, so we're gonna... And then I got two of these perennial mixes. And they're all like wild flowers. So I am so excited. I'm so excited to plant all these and just have like a whole wildflower garden going outside. So I'm gonna take you for some footage to plant these. So this is one of the flower beds we have in our yard. Every year this gets so many weeds, so I'm going to go ahead and de-weed this and get some wildflower seeds put down. We have some early spring flowers that pop up, like the hyacinths you see here that are just starting to die off, and then the crocuses that had already bloomed as well, but we also have lilies and a hydrangea bush in this area, so I just want to go ahead and put some wildflower seeds just to fill it in for the late summer, midsummer, and fall. That way we can just have some beautiful flowers all year round since this is around our deck. But I'm just gonna go ahead and get to gardening, get to weeding, and I don't know about you guys, but I am so ready to plant my actual garden, like my vegetable garden. Next week we get to get our soil and then just after Mother's Day I can plant as that will be our last frost. And so I am so excited just to get some food in the, in the ground and get to gardening this year. I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for coming along with me today. If you're in need of prayer, please leave it down in the comments. I would love to say a prayer for you, but until I see you in the next one, I hope you all have a wonderful and blessed day. Bye, y'all.